Saturday to you guys doing today? Welcome back to the vlog. I'm at Sunny Govan Radio. As you guys know, I'll let you guys know what I'm going on. 103.5 FM Radio. I'm live at 5 p.m. I'm going on the show. It's an exclusive interview for what I do. I have a passion for this. It's unreal. I've got my MacBook here doing the editing. I'm so excited for this. Yeah, yeah, I I'm excited. Jovan's in there and he'll be interviewing me technically about everything I do and how why I have a passion for it. Basically, the YouTuber has inspired me the most has been Lance Stewart and his girlfriend Lizzie Worst. And I'll see you on the radio show. <laughs> I'm actually on the radio, I'm just about to go live, I don't know if we're on a, a, a break at all. Yes, 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 Japan. Hi YouTube fans. <laughs> Hi. I'm Sonic Open Radio, just about to go live. I'm, I'm happy. Hey, Nervous, but I'm getting through it. You know, oh, well. I'll be absolutely fine. I'll be absolutely fine. Excuse me, yeah. <laughs> so we're, we're global that way as well. Uh, SunnyG.com uh, to listen to us uh, anywhere in the world, or you can listen to us by downloading the TuneIn radio app. So it's just gone five o'clock. Uh, stand on our left of uh, that Friday show, Drive Time on Sunny Gun Radio. And yeah, so as I've been explained to the listener throughout the show, I'm now joined by Ryan McAllister. How are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> can we take those headphones off and finish it? Yeah, I'll take my headphones yeah, take off. off just yeah. now because yeah. we're, we're going to try and get you one more. Longer leads. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Longer leads. Uh, you can relax. So, yeah, hello. Hi, I'm everybody. Ready. I'm Ryan McAllister. I'm a YouTuber <laughs> vlogger. Well, slash vlogger. But it's good to be on the show. Yeah, <laughs> good to have you. Who's full yeah. of energy and full of passion. That's why I love yeah. I think you need that. I'm just <laughs> like, I'm vlogging at the moment. But I've showed, I've showed Javan, obviously. And mm. I've showed... Well, I, I've, I've not seen any yet, but yeah, yeah. Um, they're really good. They're really good. Well, <laughs> so I, so you say. <laughs> no, I know. I've, I've heard great things, honestly. I mean, but this is what's always excited me, like, and intrigued me about blogging. Like, how do you get started? Do you have to set up a community first, or, or like? Well, it's just about having the camera and obviously getting set what equipment you need to use, mm. obviously. Yes. To get yourself started. Absolutely. And I started there in 2014, gave up for a year. And then I picked up the camera in 2015, that's when I started vlogging again. Because Lance Stewart, he's inspired me so much to do what I do, obviously. Mm -hmm. Because he's my favourite vlogger. Because mm -hmm. uh, ever since Vine died, yes. he's died with it. Mm -hmm. So he decided to move to YouTube and he's gained a lot of subscribers from it. Like mm -hmm. he's got 4 million subscribers now. Really? And he's oh, gained gosh. a lot from it now. Yeah, I mean, did, did he take his Vine followers <coughs> over to YouTube? Or yeah, 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 yeah. Because he's followers on Facebook, mm -hmm. Vine, Instagram. Yes. He's got like 5 million now he's just reached. Oh gosh. Quite happy for him. Oh, yeah, that's, that's a really big achievement. Oh yeah. It is. Like, 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 and for Scotland that's huge as well. Mm -hmm. but, um, but, but that's, it's, it's quite a journey though. Like with these things, does it take years to build up following like that? Or? Well, it's all about how if you've got a great vibe and you're passionate about what you do, you, obviously. You've got a great vibe. Yeah. I mean, that, See, that, yeah, I told you, I told you, everyone. <laughs> like, if I'm live streaming, I was on this live <laughs> meetup, that's where I met Javan, yes. obviously. Yes. And again, from that, mm -hmm. and then I met Javan. Yes. And I had a lot of energy from it. But now I went back uh -huh. on live months after, my energy just went mm -hmm. because I was into the vlogging, obviously, mm -hmm. having yeah. the camera mm -hmm. to my face. So I'm mm -hmm. just keeping my in energetic mm -hmm. to my yeah. vlogs obviously yeah. to keep people happy and entertained well i think well, absolutely i mean there's a reason why i say this in the workshops i do there's a reason why like when graham norton or uh, paul o'grady or oino or, or um, ricky gervais or mm. all these hosts are comedians when they come up on stage they look as if they're enjoying themselves first because then the audience is going to follow yeah. if, if you come on feeling like you don't want to be there then the audience is going to be the same as well so the fact that you're naturally like feel like you're enjoying to be there and like you want to be there, that's going to uh -huh. speak leads for your audience. So well done. Mm. No, that is so important. I mean, that's one of the things that Ryan will know and anybody else, obviously all the other people that do it, that is about yeah, yeah, being yeah. upbeat mm -hmm. and like show that passion, which again, uh, Ryan absolutely does. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to do uh, a little intro and, and these words aren't mine. It, it's, I've used the, the words that from the information that, that Ryan set, sent me. Uh, so as you've heard, uh, Ryan McAllister, Scottish YouTuber blogger, 21, uh, for those that are interested, uh, he started getting into making videos uh, when he was nine or 10 and used to make daft videos that that's Ryan's word like there, not Harry Potter yeah, obviously but like daft videos uh, such as uh, Harry Potter uh, using acting skills with a small cheap camera uh, Ryan gave up for a while as he was getting older but when he reached 14 he started to pick up the camera again uh, to see where uh, see where it would, to see if it would work out for him now Lance Stewart you heard, you heard Ryan mention there uh, the entertainer vlogger from Vine and Facebook inspired Ryan to do what he does 
So he uh, so he tried it out and it's going well for him, which it is, I think it is, and, and obviously ah, yeah, it's it going to go much better after this. Oh. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, this, this is where you're paying skyrockets, mate. You know, like, this yeah. is the whole idea, you know. <laughs> I'm just sort of in uh, most of my you, uh, young subscribers and old subscribers, people, I don't know who's actually watching. They might be 60, they might be mm. 50, 30, and mm. their 40s. Mm. So. Yeah, yeah, and that's the thing as well, because it's going to be a big age group and it's going to be like everyone yeah just because of fact it's just mostly like, the young ones that love youtube like yeah, if they're yeah. at school and they don't have time to actually watch your but content this is the thing this is mm. what's actually made me feel like an old man already at the age of 26 it's like you know people kids are into something that wasn't a craze when i was growing up i mean youtube was popular but it wasn't the thing like it is now the thing that all the youngsters do all these do tv is no longer really a thing yeah i know like it's okay. yeah. But it's, YouTube's been ruined by one specific person, oh. Lo, uh, you know, Logan Paul. Yeah, he, he was at this. He got into trouble. Yeah, he got yeah. into serious uh -huh. bad trouble. Mm -hmm. I don't know how you pronounce it. Well, 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 well yeah, uh -huh. he, the suicide. What did yeah, yeah, suicide forest. He went there and yeah, he recorded yeah. a, a dead yeah, yeah, person. Yeah. 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 yeah, and he was recording everything. Uh -huh. and that just ruined YouTube. But there's a one man. It's a YouTuber, Casey Neistat. <clears> you probably know. Oh, He's yeah. trying to fix everything. He's having interviews with other producers and mm. people who work behind YouTube. So when you say like he's ruined it and he's trying to fix it, what do you mean? Like people are t going off YouTube? As yeah, a it's like then? small YouTubers are not getting willing the willing to get paid uh, because of they're putting so much effort into their videos mm -hmm. yes. to get paid, yes, and I, only one person changed all that for YouTube. Uh, yeah, I mean this, that's the thing. It can it can be so fragile. These things kind of just want yeah, to yeah, go yeah, wrong yeah. And stuff. But I mean it's good old honest. Just being yourself and being honest about yourself and being honest with why you're doing vlogging in the first place. You know, if you're vlogging for yourself before anything else, then I think you're always going to have appeal for the people who follow you. Yeah, people yeah, are yeah. always going to enjoy following you. And that's that's the stuff that won't get so easily beaten by when people like Logan Paul doing it and stuff. Oh, I know. I mean, are they still going, Logan Paul? Mm. Yeah, they're still going. Really? Still going ham. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Daily vlogging every single day. Oh, my goodness. Uh, I don't know how he does it. I, when I, I was at Menorca. In Spain, that's mm -hmm. where I did my daily vlogs. Mm -hmm. I was doing it for the, I think it was like the past six days to two weeks when mm -hmm. I was there. Did it straight and it was so tiring, I was up to three in the morning mm -hmm. editing my butt off. Really? <laughs> yeah, it was so hard, it was hard work, but I'm just sticking to like weekly yeah, vlogs yeah. and keeping it going and keeping it going until I build myself and build my subscribers to go mm. with me. I'm going to like well, probably try daily vlogging one day. Well, no, well, you, I you know. can do it. It's I a thing when you can afford it's that. It's a lot of hard work. Yeah. Well, mm -hmm. I mean, no, but you're, you're throwing yourself into it, you know? Like all the motivations. There. I'm it's working at the same way. time as well because I work in a hotel and. Yeah, I'm yeah, trying yeah. to do, do this to you're in the hotel. I don't vlog in the hotel. <laughs> no. Only see if I'm at nights out and I'm getting a lot to get drunk, obviously. <laughs> when, uh, <laughs> when in I'm, the hotel? Yeah, not in the hotel, but... Dr drunk and coffee. Night out, <laughs> like, <laughs> like cam, uh -huh. cam face and you've got your cat house and stuff like that. Yeah. Yeah. Other clubs available. Yeah. That's what I... Rum teenage 21-year-old Yeah, the rum shack, absolutely. Um, so, the, the first question I had, uh, and just because of how it went, normally I would email, but I didn't have sort of time to do that, just how things went. But the, these questions are, are they're not, they're not difficult. They're, they're standard, easy, easy, you know, good, good questions yeah, yeah. for you. Uh, obviously centered around what you do. Uh, so the first question uh, for you is, you, so, you know, as we, we probably touched on, uh, well, we did already just there in the intro, is that you started making videos at age nine or 10. Yeah. One of these was a Harry Potter video. Tell the listeners about that and where your parents supported, uh, supportive uh, of you of making videos at such a young age. Well, at a young age, I was like in my own room and I had this little weird crap camera. Uh -huh. <laughs> and I just decided to pick up the camera to try it out one time. And I didn't put any editing into it because the editing softwares were like crap back in the day. Mm. That's when I just started picking up the camera and I would just sit in my room, act everything out like the movie from Harry Potter. Right. Like Philosopher's Stone. I uh, did that mm -hmm. and I was just throwing things about. <laughs> and I, I had a wand at the time and I, sw I, I thought I was like magical and all that. <laughs> 
And then I, I didn't know about selfies at the time. Oh. So I picked oh. up a camera, done my first selfie, I had pure beach blonde hair. <laughs> 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 oh, no, wait, it was you that started the selfie, now we both started it. This is it. it we was not, I wish I started the <laughs> selfie, but I didn't. Is he foreshadowing <laughs> the time? Oh, so it was already existing at the time. So. Yeah, it probably was, but I was like that. Had no braces at the time. My teeth no, I think we need to add this to Scotland's invention list. We had the television, the telephone, you know, and many other things. I think the selfie. Yeah. The invention of the selfie. Exactly. That was like 10 years ago, 11 We're years ago. Take, <laughs> take that as one of our own. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, so, and were your parents supportive of it? You well, they didn't that know what I was that? really doing at the time because right. they didn't know like about YouTube and stuff back mm. in the day. I didn't know about YouTube back in the day as well because yeah. I used to like put them, take these videos, put them on my computer, store them somewhere so I can keep them. Okay. But obviously, years after, I just lost them. And how, how are they now? Like, are they uh, now? Or, yeah, they're supportive or, 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 now. They're yeah. always watching my YouTube videos. Mm. I've got like uh, foster carers as well. They are really supportive. Mm. They're like, I'm passionate about it, I've told them about it, they love what I do. Fantastic. But they don't watch yeah. my videos because obviously they're trying to work their phone still. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if, you are, if you're listening, um, my first carer's uh, daughter, and if you're listening, hi, shout out to you. <laughs> Please learn how to operate a phone. <laughs> <laughs> but they're really good, I'm helping them out, I'm always there to support them and help them work the phone. Oh, that's good stuff. Yeah. I mean, that's the thing, what are they going to do when you one day move out? What will they do? Probably after when I'm 25 and 26 I'll probably move out but no, they're helping no, me. No, I think they'll follow you. They're helping me <laughs> towards like getting my own house and getting my own well, I mean, flat. To be honest, like 25, 26 you'll probably be in Milan at that time anyway or yeah, something. Yeah, yeah. Possibly. <laughs> That's if YouTube helps me out. <laughs> I'm at the side of my pool, just doing a vlog, you know, a vlog. Sitting in the water. I just hope I, I'm not, I don't go on my phone and I don't drop it in the water and then I'm stranded. Well if I do, oh, yeah. at that point you can just buy a new one because that's it, you know you'll be, you'll be that, that, that famous. It's just like too much money nowadays. Yeah. And, you'll, and you'll, be like, like, houses aren't cheap. you'll be like, what was that guy, what was that show? I don't know, I don't care. You'll be like, you'll forget about me. As a I've you just got something to ask you. Uh, join my journey, be a savage, he's in the Savage Squad. Oh. Uh, yeah? Yeah, we, we are in the that's Savage Squad. That's my motto on YouTube. Yeah, that's Jonathan, it. Jonathan, be a savage. You'll be able to say it again at the end of the show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> at the end of the interview, yeah. <laughs> I mean, what qualifies, what makes you a savage? What, how do you qualify as a savage? I don't know, it's just the way I go. I'm oh, really? so energetic, I'll do anything for the vlog. I'm trying to do exploring vlogs now, like <laughs> nice. the abandoned boat house I went to. Yeah, and that's actually one of my questions. It's going to be about that, so. That was a good vlog. Wait, it was, yeah. that, that, that was really good. We'll, we'll get that's coming up. So is, is um, that a little bit later, Another but question. that's good you should, that you mentioned it because mm -hmm. that, that's one of my favourite ones. They're all good, but that's one of my favourites yeah, so yeah, far. Yeah. Um, so can you so firstly explain to, to the listeners, for those that may not know him, uh, who Lance Stewart is, then tell the listeners what it is that you like about him and why he inspires you so much. Well, Lance first started from Vine, what Vine is, it's like six second videos of what you're like skits and stuff like that. Yeah. It's like funny videos that yeah, last like six seconds. That's like Ryan Gosling's doesn't want to eat his cereal. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 And if you've not seen that one, it's <laughs> no, so Logan no, Paul, no he funny. used to be on Vine, but ever since Vine died. But there's supposed to be a Vine 2 coming out. What, 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 oh, happened, sure. what happened to Vine? Like, what it like? just died completely because they didn't make enough profit from oh. it. Not enough money. But ever since they've just got more money and they're making a Vine 2. So I guess Lance Stewart and everyone's just got to join on there to make mm. sick videos again. But that's what I might do. I might join Vine because I used to have a Vine account. Well, totally just act works. things out and like mock people. Mm -hmm. Like not mock them in that way, like funny. <laughs> yeah, yeah, be, you'd be a comedian about it. Yeah, yeah. Not, like yeah, comedian. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, no, I, I remember right. Good. So this is a slightly off topic. Sorry, sorry, Jim, but I mean, like, th there's something on YouTube that called the ad apocalypse, where it's basically was like uh, it's something like YouTube, the whole advertising system, which gives YouTubers their money. It changed. And oh, it's AdSense. Yeah, you've got yeah. Google AdSense. That helped me out. I only got paid sixty pounds for it because I was working hard on my videos at the time. Like right, I used okay, to edit all my videos on my phone. Mm. I had a MacBook at the time when I went to Turkey, mm -hmm. and obviously I've uh, just got a new MacBook and editing on that. Cool. Nice one, man. So, using yeah. Dino Cup Pro. It's oh, amazing yeah. thing. So, uh, you set up a YouTube channel in 2014 and stopped for a year, then in 2015 you went back. What's your guys' best part of the so interview we'll so far? Live on air. I'm saying that being, being here with Juven. Oh, and with yourself. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh, and we have some spicy jammy beets coming in as well. Yeah, we do. Yeah. <laughs> How are you? Well done, that's yeah. it. We're having a laugh. We're training you. <laughs> Were you listening, bro? Were you listening? Yeah. Did you enjoy it? Ah, I told you. How good was it? Was it funny? I told you. This is the studio, guys. I need to vlog everybody. That's a wrap for the radio. I enjoyed it so much. Just done some takes for the Super Saturday. Ah, it went good. Ah, oh, brilliant. Uh, knock it. That's what I do to him. In the vlogs. Pretty good though. Awesome. Uh. Awesome. Awesome. <laughs> I love it. That was good. It's like you're holding my hand there. Take my hand! Ah! Come on! That was good. Keep it up. Cinematic on the roll. Oh, somebody dropped the phone. I got that in the vlog. Yeah, give my new shoes, Ryan. What are those? What are those? What? They're pretty dope, but what are those? What are those? Two days later. What's up guys? How you guys doing today? Join my journey to be a savage. I've met one of my subscribers in the campus right now. Hi guys! Hi, how are you? Amy McNall, shout out to Granny Liz, love Ryan McAllister's vlog. Amazing! Well it's good to be here. This girl watches my vlogs constantly. She watched my uh, hockey one. have a problem. I'm in the process of editing right now. The radio vlog, the one that's going up just now. But the problem is we don't have an outro for this vlog. So I'm having to end it here. The thing is, uh, you know, Ryan was vlogging the entire day. Never had charge in his batteries to end the vlog. So I'm going to end the vlog right here for you guys. If you guys did enjoy, don't forget smash that like button right in the face. And don't forget turn on my post notifications on so you guys never miss a new battle when it comes out and how to turn on my post notifications on all you guys have to do is head over to my youtube channel right now click that little bell icon on my youtube channel so you can receive that banger as i said and don't forget guys join my journey be a savage be like me and i will see you guys in the next video